Warm-up is causing some problems for public works crews in Kansas City. At least three water main breaks were reported today. Jake Peterson tells us how the city is working on the problem. Hey, Jake. Well, Elizabeth, the water pipes are four feet below ground, but they've started to freeze. A few days with temps in the 40s and 50s can actually move the pipes. been watching the water run most of the day. But David Little isn't talking about the H2O inside his business. Rather, he's referring to a water main break next to his shop on 85th Street. He spent most of the day without water. In a perfect world, the water would never go off. We're accustomed to doing without the water. <laughs> it's, yeah, you turn the water off for a while. That's because David says the pipes in his area are old, and this happens a couple times a year. City leaders say that could be part of the problem. Some some years during during the depression, during the war years, uh, the pipe quality wasn't it wasn't quite as good, and so that we see that those areas breaking more frequently. Assistant Water Services Director Jim Mellon says some annexed areas are also bad because the pipes were in place before the city took over. He says all of that mixed with the hot and cold temps creates a problem. The ground dries out and the pipe moves a little bit and that movement uh, reveals your weak points and, and you have main breaks. Crews repaired the busted pipes and repatched the pavement. Nearby homeowners went without drinking water for a few hours. David Little hopes the water main breaks stop. The city is working on a plan. And slowly but surely, those old pipes are being replaced. There are 2,700 miles of pipes in Kansas City. Crews started a replacement program, but so far they've only replaced about 70 miles of piping. Jake Peterson, NBC Action News.